Good morning. Welcome to an Ace of Spades video. But it's not an ordinary Ace of Spades video because we have a different version on our plates. Uh, this is the Beta 0.76 RC, the release candidate. Last night, uh, the developers gave out this testing release um, for people to try out. It showcases a load of changes from the previous main release, 0.75. So I thought it would be best just to make a video outlining these changes and really my opinions on it. Uh, first up, you'll see the two little men with spades we've got there. Uh, the colours have changed quite a lot. Namely, they're both rather darker than they used to be. Which I think is a nice change. It's, as the changelog says, it's not so neon. It's not so bright and out of place. So it's a simple but quite a nice change for this version. And next up is spectator mode. You can still fly around, but left clicking binds you to a player view. By clicking again, it then cycles through the players. To snap out, you literally just move away from your target. It's really nice and simple, but a very good tool. Okay, next thing, top right, just above the map, you'll notice a coordinate indicator. This is uh, very useful actually when playing with uh, friends because you no longer have to scan your eyes up and down the map to know where you are. You can just pull it out. Okay, rifle. This has seen a lot of changes and it's been sparking a lot of debate. It used to, in 0.75, have 10 bullets in its clip and 50 in reserve, but it now only has 5 in its clip and 40 in its, in its reserve. But if you notice, it's a lot more accurate than the 0.75 rifle, which is amazing. We've wanted that for some time since 0.75 came out. But in order to balance things out, the clip size has changed and the fire rate has been quite significantly reduced. Not sure whether I quite agree with the amount of fire rate reduction, but it certainly seems more balanced at the moment. Moving on to SMG. Again, bottom right. It still holds 30. It then has 150 in its, in its reserve, rather than 120, so that's one whole clip more. Now I'm just going to walk around this gen map. In the mid-range it's certainly very quick to kill, which is where it should be it should be very good, since it's an SMG. At uh, longer ranges it's still slightly hard to control the recoil, but that's perfectly fine. Okay, shotgun. I notice it's still pretty good at short range, that's what it's designed for. Unfortunately, it's a gen map, so I didn't get much chance to use it. But here's some of the changes. It now holds eight, 8 in its clip, and it has more bullets in reserve. Its fire rate is much quicker than before. So yeah, I think that's just about it. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'll see you guys soon.